Hi, I'm Gina Salazar. Welcome back to the Better Arizona Show. When most of us think of dental implants, we probably think of those old teeth cleaning commercials <laughs> with dentures sitting inside a cup, but boy, have things changed. That's why today we have Dr. Gasser here. He is with Gasser Dental Corporation. Welcome, Dr. Gasser. It's great to be here. Thank you. So, Dr. Gasser, tell us a little bit about how dental implants have changed over your 30-year career. Well, in main ways, they're more predictable, they're more affordable, and they're less invasive. So show us some examples of how these dental implant procedures have evolved and changed. Sure. For 17 years, I've been doing the restorative and surgical aspects of dental implants in a dedicated office that's focused on implants. And most of the time, we've used what we call an implant-assisted or snap-on denture. So we're showing that here on this model, okay. where actually the implants help to hold the denture in place. So it is a device that the patient removes every day. They can clean it, but then they can put it back in so the implants help hold it in place. Right. And that typically is done in what we call two phases. So there's an implant insertion, then a few months of healing, and then the teeth themselves are constructed. Two phases, and they are removable. But the trend's towards something newer. So why has the all-on-floor procedure that you do become so popular? Well, mostly because it can be almost always done in one surgical visit. So you have less discomfort, less anxiety, yeah. um, and, and less expense. It's simply a more predictable way to provide permanently anchored teeth quicker than we used to be able to do so. I can imagine that not having your teeth on when you wake up in the morning and having to clean them is probably a little bit uncomfortable and maybe not as clean and sanitary for some people. Absolutely. Most people want permanently anchored teeth and they are more predictable in that way. Tell us about the success rate of the Malo All On 4. It's been very successful, right? Tremendously. Over a long period of time, for 20 years now, he's been doing them all over the world in various clinics, tens of thousands of them. And since we are a Malo Clinic trained and affiliated and supported, we follow his exact protocol in the office. And therefore, with that protocol, we've been able to enjoy a success rate that's similar to theirs at 98%, Great. with 304 cases uh, that are in service over the past seven years. So we feel very confident about that. And that's what I'm really holding here is what's called the Malo Clinic All On Four. Mm -hmm. So this is permanent. It does not come in or out and most people would prefer that along with the fact that it's quicker and there's not two phases there's just one single phase to get those teeth put in in most cases and of course everyone's different they all come to you with different needs so, true. so tell me a little bit about how people can learn more about this and what might be the right fit for them well you know your your point is excellent everybody is different um, these procedures we've discussed are for people that need a complete set of teeth in a jaw um, some people don't need quite so much. So it's really important to find out what the person's condition is. Mm -hmm. So we offer a free consultation. They can have a free dental CAT scan done as well. So we can see the specifics of their case and just listen to them, learn what it is their goals are, and everybody's different. So we can then provide options that they can consider. Dr. Gasser, thank you so much for being here today. Our pleasure, thank you. The Better Arizona Show will be right back.